Oh, good. Did my fingernails. <laughs> I'm Dick Marquis, Richard Marquis. Uh, I live in the Pacific Northwest. And I've been 30 years on Whidbey Island. I've been like 46 years blowing glass, and I have a fairly short span of attention, so I keep changing what I'm doing. And over that period of time, I've probably made, you know, couple thousand objects and they don't often relate to each other. The last few years I've been working on this process called granulari, which is this uh, lumpy, Italian lumpy ware. And that's what I've been working on the last few years and that's what I'm sort of uh, concentrating on here at the museum. And here we go. Rolling up the marini around that glass tube. This is, has the, every color I've got over there, so it's a compatibility test. It's actually making something I need. Okay. Yeah. That'd be the clear. Yeah, I think it'll only probably be like this size. Well, granular in Italian means granular or lumpy. And what it is, is like this piece here, it's, it's some hard glass, hard white glass, surrounded by a soft glass of another color. And when you blow it out, the, it just becomes bumpy. It's sort of like having blowing a, a chewing gum with uh, BBs in it. And the BBs stay hard. And that's sort of, that's, that's what I've been working with for a long time. And then, it's something that's not exactly pretty. That's one reason I'm interested in it. Yeah. Very odd, odd object. Like a studded tire. Yeah. All my whole life I've, I've, I've collected things and I've never had enough money to collect really nice things. So I, I sort of have this uh, collection of beat up uh, objects that I like to arrange and play with. And uh, sometimes I try to make, you know, something that's really lowbrow, try to turn into a, a more of a highbrow item. It's hard to tell by some of the shapes I make that I actually know a lot about classic forms because I've sort of I've, I've been there and done that. And now I'm interested in, in doing these more like uh, primitive shapes, primitive forms. Okay, these guys are very cartoony. They're, they're called cartoon cars, and uh, they just sort of developed from some of the other work I did. And here we go. We got our visiting artist, Richard Marcus. want to make anything here that I can't make myself. So I'm sort of limiting my, the scale I'm working at, and I'm just trying to streamline a couple of processes I've been work, working on and experiment with a couple other shapes I'm interested in. And uh, I've only made one of these things before put it to get, putting it together hot. And so, uh, and it was really hard to do, so I'm trying to streamline that process and see if we get a, you know, two or three good ones. That's, that's the most important thing that I'm making some other shapes that I'm interested in working with later. I'll probably, I won't finish anything here at the museum. I'll take, be taken back to my shop and I'll add things to it and I'll, I'll knock back the shiny glass and make it duller and just sort of, I'm not sure what I'll do with them. No, let's just sort of see what happens. Okay, now we'll torch that area. I spent the last nine days at my shop uh, making the cane, preparing for this. And uh, if we were really efficient and went really fast, we'd go through it all in three days. And I don't want to go through it in three days. I want it to last a while. It looks good. Somebody should suit up. So we're going to sort of, you know, make sure we make really nice ones.